Good morning, everyone. Damn, I look hella different, but today is another trading day. I know this is, I'm catching the vlog very late. It is about an hour left until market closes. Yeah, closes. I woke up pretty late. Um, I didn't go live, I didn't live stream with my YouTube at all, but it's a good thing taking a break a little bit. Just not a break, but like just to fix my mental, like trading wise. But um, we took one trade today and we are down about $1,500, but I am paper trading. I'm trying to build more conviction and yeah, let me show you guys the trade real quick. All right, so basically what I saw in this trade was we were obviously in a big downtrend, big downtrend overall. And I was expecting to see this low right here and this hourly fair value gap that hasn't been mitigated yet. So basically we have this order block right here, expecting an expansion move off this order block right here. So basically, we come up, tap this order block right here, and we engulf this candle, and this is the change of state of delivery, whatever you wanna call it, boom, entered off here. Stop was above these highs, or this fair value gap high right here, because I, I, we, we honestly could have souped these highs up here. And as you tell, we kinda did, we came down, we were in profit for a little bit, and then price decided to reverse on us right here. I was up about over a hundred, I was, up about 40 points here but then price reversed back up was expecting this low right here but price eventually just kept pumping here but we took one trade here and we took an L on the paper trading here down about 1400 bucks just gonna be trading on paper for a little bit trying to build more conviction but those are the trades we took I'm going to be hitting the gym very soon but yeah I'll catch you guys all in a little bit all right we just got done uploading our trade recap on youtube here we're just watching a little bit of tjr here just this trade recap overall but over here we have over right here we have the trade recap of today's trades just uploaded it and everything all right boys we're about to head to the gym right now i gotta run a few errands but i think i might start rocking like a middle part low key um <laughs> i don't even know so let me know what you guys think i might start rocking the middle part so we'll see what happens and do my teeth look super fucking white? Uh... Alright boys, we just got done with the workout. I had a pretty decent workout, honestly. Had some chest and a little bit of shoulders and did a bit cardio today, which is great. I'm um, trying to work on my cardio a little bit, trying to slim down, hopefully. It's not helping even though I'm eating McDonald's every fucking day. Um, I know it's not going to be helping, but there's like nothing to eat and I just... I just, I, at least I chose something that's not as terrible from McDonald's, so that's great. But other than that, guys, I'm gonna head home and do some more back testing and do some more work. All right, boys, I've been back testing for a little bit now. It's uh, 6.02, Watch, still watching All American, but we have food here. We got some rice, chicken, and some little bit of fish and peppers here. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, back testing is literally kicking my ass. My strategy is not working, but it seems to work now, but I gotta keep working on it. I gotta keep finding something that I need to fix on, and I'll catch you guys all in a little bit. Partial right at this level, and you can- All right, guys, I'm back. It is about 12.47 a.m. where I am right now. I've been back testing, doing a lot of like YouTube videos, a lot of research. I learned a lot about fucking uh, PD arrays. Like there are stuff that I've never even heard of, like propulsion box or whatever, or even vacuum box. Um, I had no idea what the fuck they were. I did a lot of research, um, watched some ICT core content, a little bit of it, and did a lot of back testing. Here's the most recent FX replay that I did. I did a, I pretended like I was on a 150K account and I just racked up to 9,000 cause that's the total profit where you need to be at. Um, obviously I went down to six, like negative 6K and then I just eventually brought myself back up um, a little bit more. Literally did it perf pretty perfectly. 47% win rate is not bad. I'm gonna try my best to up up the percentage rate and up in my total PNL. Um, at most and here's like the average rr i did like the i did the max was like 2r at most and then um just stuff like this but yeah guys i'm gonna call it a day and i will catch you guys all the next time